This is JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Dean Perrine, and welcome to JSA TV. We are coming at you on location at ITW 2018 in the windy city of Chicago, Illinois, and I am here with Mr. Vincent English. Vincent is the CEO of Megaport. Did I get that? It is the CEO. I, I, I looked down thinking, did I say that wrong? Is the CEO of Megaport. Vincent, welcome to JSA TV. Thanks very much, Dean. Lovely to be back here again. Outstanding. And so how's the show going for you so far? Good. Very busy. Uh, very busy day yesterday and, and yesterday evening. We hosted our event here mm -hmm. uh, last night, so it was well attended. So we're really happy with that with all of our partners um, attending. Uh, mm -hmm. So that was really good. Um, and busy day today, and tomorrow's just as bad. <laughs> <laughs> just as bad. I love it. I know. I, my, my feet are about to fall off. I can only imagine how yours must feel. Yeah. But, um, Vincent, for our uh, viewers that don't already know, how, why don't you tell them a little bit about Megaport? Sure, yeah. Um, well, well, since its foundation, the whole idea was to increase connectivity to cloud service providers. Mm -hmm. And within a data center footprint, which we've connected and built out geographically today to over 200 locations, uh, we're enabling uh, cloud service providers to connect to customers in a very seamless and easy to go fashion. Um, in burstable speeds, uh, pay as you go, um, and in a very flexible manner that allows the same way that they connect to the cloud service provider mm -hmm. that the networking is now managing and mirroring that same experience. Uh, so it's basically to make it very simple and easy for customers to consume the cloud. Outstanding. So let's stay on the uh, the cloud theme there. Um, so what, you recently announced your ability to support hybrid um, network connections to uh, Google Cloud. Why don't you talk to us a little bit more about that? Sure, yeah. Uh, Google has been one of our long-standing partners since we founded the company back in 2013. So people know about Google then. They've yeah. heard of Google before? They've been around. <laughs> um, so... Um, Initially, their product was at a layer three level, uh, which was uh, Google uh, GCI. Um, and recently, I think it was about two weeks ago at this stage, um, they've announced their layer two or a direct connect version called uh, Google Cloud uh, Interconnect Partner. Mm -hmm. um, and so we've been working with them very closely over the years and in the integration with Google uh, on their new product at layer two level, uh, where we're deeply integrated. Um, and I've done some beta testing with them as they've gone through that with their product. Uh, we were there to help them launch their product across our large platform and mm -hmm. across 10 actual nodes uh, on their launch day. So that was really important for us and equally very important for, for Google themselves. Um, so much so that we had we had over, uh, I think it was five or six customers within the first two or three hours <laughs> al right? already using the product, which was great. That's outstanding, actually. Yeah, That's pretty, pretty crazy. It's pretty good, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so yeah. it's going well. It's going really well. Outstanding. Okay, so I'm I'm going to go ahead and name drop a little bit. Obviously, Google, AWS, um, Oracle, Office 365, all of these... Um, all of these are, you know, partners, customers, people that you are working with. You know, what does... What does having that kind of roster, those names in that roster, what does that what does that mean to your customers and do for your customers? How does it help you do what you do? Yeah, uh, look, it's very important. Uh, we've spent a lot of time. The power of our, our portal itself um, creates a creates a kind of one stop shop. Mm -hmm. And what we've done with each one of those partners is we've fully integrated them, and so we've actually gone straight and integrated into their cloud platform directly. And mm -hmm. um, so when a customer connects across Megaport, they're able to easily access access each, each one of those services sure. um, and so for us and for our customers it means then you don't have to build your own network you don't have to find your own private way of connecting mm -hmm. to it that we're able to make sure make that very seamless and easy so our customers have an easy experience for the cloud service providers themselves it allows them quicker and greater access through our footprint and locations to actually consume their cloud products so um yeah, <laughs> that's that's pretty awesome, and, yeah, yeah. And, and a nice, a nice, very simple way of understanding. Right. You know, the fact that you've got those names, um, you know, those logos, um, kind of in in your fold means better, bigger, and better things for your customers. Yeah, I look at it's it's important. You know, sometimes we have to pinch ourselves too. I mean, it, there's a credibility <laughs> factor here too that we have. We have a great platform. No we've doubt. got great software engineers and engineers yes. to help to build this on both sides. I think that's a real endorsement for us in our company. You know, mm -hmm. small company starting out originally in Australia, but as we've grown, uh, we're bringing large technology companies as part of our ecosystem and, and that's because the product works and you're, so let's talk about that ecosystem you know you've got a very very large ecosystem um, so um, you know what does that mean um, for service providers um, it means reach it means extension so that um, not only uh, customers in on our ecosystem not only going to connect to a cloud service provider but can also connect to managed service providers other service providers or even just content providers um, and that allows that 
effectively allow easy connectivity. Mm -hmm. Um, So for the cloud service providers themselves, um, applications and storage and all of those features that they've got Mm -hmm. are now readily available. And not only that, the match, like I said earlier on, match the way they're consumed and very easy for them. So it's it's an all around, it's it's all hand in hand that works together inside the ecosystem. Vincent, thank you very much. But I want to talk a little bit about the future. Um, What do things look like for Megaport, say, 6 to 12 months down the road? What can we expect to hear from you this time next year at ITW? Uh, lots of exciting things. That's one thing we, we seem to be good at. Um, you are very good at that, absolutely. Uh, um, you know, we, we launched our new product, MCR, back in January, just around PTC time. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's going really well, and that allows, uh, allows us to actually go from cloud to cloud connectivity now. Um, and that's, that's going to be a really f- important development in the future. Um, and we see that as mid data needs to be used more and more. It's not mm-hmm. just in store, it's where data moves to, and uh, the facilitation of that is really important. So we'll be focused a lot on that. Um, today we're in 209 locations, uh, or nearly 110 on ramps, I think. I'm not really sure. It changes every day. Um, <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, so, you know, we're planning to be in 300 locations by the end of June 2019. So, you know, we're. we're, we're that'll be big. Yeah, that'll be big <laughs> as well. You know, so and we're going to continue to work with our, mm-hmm. our cloud partners partners and are enriching our ecosystem and bring in more partners. So there's a lot of, it's a three-way kind of play at the moment. So yeah, it's very exciting, but very busy, which is great. Vincent, this has been excellent. Thank you very much. Let's do it again next year, shall we? Yeah. Thanks very much, Dean. And folks, uh, don't forget the the port, little Megaport is megaport.al. Megaport.al. You heard it from from me and from Vincent. And also, don't check out or don't check out. Do check out Vincent's video that he did with uh, with our fearless leader Jamie Scatokataya at PTC just a few short months ago, right? That's right. Yeah, back in January. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Um, have a great rest of the show. Yep. Okay. Thanks very much, Dean. You got thank it. You. you got it. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We'll see you soon. Mm-hmm.